Southeast Asia is home to 600 million people. Of those, 100 million people are dependent on agriculture for their livelihood. However, farmers face many challenges, including unpredictable weather due to climate change and lack of access to market and good information to help them tackle these problems. As a result, farmers have faced failed crops, low productivity, and loss of income. With smart seeds in Indonesia and green coffee in Vietnam, we aim to help farmers improve their yield by giving them access to the information they need. These projects offer a unique approach by combining source data and field data. Source data from satellite images provide detailed information, such as evaporation, soil moisture, and land cover. Field data collected by enumerators gives us insight from the farmers regarding their land and crops. This information is integrated through the Lizard platform and delivered to our customers as easy-to-digest information such as flood alerts and drought monitor via SMS or a mobile app. Services provided for subscribed members are Crop Calendar, Gap Advice, and Market Information. In Indonesia, Smart Seeds will target 100,000 vegetable farmers, specifically cucumber, tomato, and chili smallholders in three provinces. In Vietnam, Green Coffee will target 100,000 coffee farmers in four provinces in the Central Highland region. The information farmers will receive is expected to support farmers, practice farming more efficiently and sustainably, boost productivity by 10%, lower cost of input by 10%, gain a direct link to buyers with good price. Both projects will also involve and bring benefits to other actors, including input suppliers, governmental and non-governmental institutions, traders and wholesale companies, as well as farmer groups. Geodata for agriculture and water, improving food security in developing countries by using satellite data. Smart Seas and Green Coffee are part of the Geodata for Agriculture and Water program of the Netherlands Space Office, funded by the Government of the Netherlands. Thank you to the Netherlands Space Office and all partners involved.